What's going on, y'all? JT here with an unboxing and look at the new Teen Karate Morocco. So you guys stay tuned for the end of this video because I do have a giveaway that we're going to be doing. The giveaway is going to actually be this Friday at 630 uh mountain standard time so stay tuned for the end of the video for that but i got this from jj customs i'm going to put a link down below in the description they do have just about a, every single team corrali vehicle in stock and they do have parts and stuff on so go over there and check them out there'll be a link down below in the description to their website and then i also have a spool for this from speed tech rc it's a 42 spool they're one of the few companies that it makes actually good durable spools for the team karate car so don't be fooled about getting other spools out there the ones i've run i have one on my python that i'm running and it's a 35 tooth and you guys know i'm getting about 105 or six miles per hour still running the stock electronics on it so i have it uh, changed my i think i changed it once but went back to the stock electronics um with it and then i ran it or actually um, I did change out the speaker, so I did put a uh, Max 5 in there. So, but the motor is still stock running 6S with the 35 to school. So, I'm going to do the same thing for this. Except I'm going to leave the speed controller, the stock one, in here. And I'm going to see what kind of speeds we get stuck out the box. As you see, they're saying 65, must, uh, 65 plus miles per hour, which I believe this truck's going to get every bit of 65 uh, miles per hour because they've got some fast cars. Um, with this so let me uh, quit my yap and let's go ahead and let's get this box opened up and you guys know it oh yeah gotta love the smell of a new rc car so let me go ahead and get this out real quick and let's see what we got it all right y'all we got this bad boy out and he looks good look like he's gonna be really 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 fast so like i said i did get this from uh, jj customs i'll leave a link below in the description and then also at the end of the video, I'll tell you about the giveaway. There's going to be a three twenty-five dollar gift certificates that are going to be given away to Speed Tech RC. And speaking of Speed Tech RC, I do have a spool for this. So this is a forty-two spool that I'll be putting in. I won't do it on the first round, but I will be doing it for a speed test um, for this real soon. So I'll put a link below in the description as well as a coupon code you can use to get a couple bucks off too. But they're one of the people who are one of the companies actually that makes good spools for cars. I know, um, they have some for teen karate cars. I do run one on my Python. I run a 35 tooth in there and I'm going to run a 42. Um, you guys can see in there. So like I said, I'll leave a link below in the description for this. And these are actually a perfect fit for these particular vehicles. Uh, so I'm not sure what gearing I'm actually going to use with it, but I'll try with the stock electronics. And then at some point in time, um, I may change it out and make it into a speed truck to see if we can get 100 and, I don't know, 12, 15, 20 plus miles per hour. We'll have to check, definitely change out the tires and stuff for this. But so, but anyway, taking a look at this truck, suspension setup and stuff is really good. Um, for this, you guys see that there. Of course, it doesn't have a battery in it, but um, I'll be running this on 4S and 6S. And the tires are going to be good for ready to run stock out the box. When I start doing 70 plus miles per hour, I'll definitely have to change these tires out for this. But I like the layout that they have for this. I've never, I've never been a big fan of a green color or kind of this lime green color, but this actually pops and looks good. It kind of just matches up with everything with the structure or the shape of the body. And then also just how low profile the vehicle looks. So uh, moving this off, uh, shed a little light here so you guys can see that a little bit better. Um, you do get threaded body shocks in the front and then also the rear, and you do get sway bars and stuff for it. And this is of course a 6S capable speed controller and motor. This is a 2050 and that's 150 amp. Now, Team Karate is working on um, a few updates. So I think when they're coming out with a possible version two, there's gonna be some with the chassis or tower to tower brace with it. So, um, but you can also purchase that separately. If you already have one or have any of the Team Karate cars that just recently came out, you can purchase that for, I think it's about 60 to 70 bucks um, to add that on there. Um, this does come with a 13 tooth pinion gear and I believe that's a 52 5.2 tooth spur gear or center dip um, that's on here. But one thing I like about their electronics is you can go from 6 volts, which it is stock out the box, to 7.4 uh, volts. So I'll definitely be going ahead for the first run and upping that voltage just a little bit. And I'm going to change the punch setting to 5 too. So I'm expecting on the first run, I just kind of want to go ahead and get that out of the way to see what kind of 
just to run it like that. There's no use to me running and making that change settings. So if you guys want to see a video on how to adjust those settings, let me know. But you guys see the way this chassis and stuff is laid out. It's laid out really good. At some point in time, I'll probably be doing an XTR conversion for this, getting a couple of the XTR parts for it. Uh, possibly chassis, shock tower, and changing out the front and stuff just a little bit. But then again, I, I may not. I don't know. Um, we'll see. Because I bash, but I don't try to... I guess I call it bash and crash my cars. Um, so I, I don't, I'm not a big fan of always trying to work on cars and stuff, but we're going to take it out. Definitely. We're going to definitely run it off road um, with this. So this actually, like I said, guys, this looks good. I can't wait to get this running. And also real quick for the giveaway before I forget. So what you guys need to do is I'm going to put a link down below in the description. You need to go to Instagram and yell for this one. You have to have Instagram. You need to go to Instagram and go to Speed Tech RC. And what you need to do is you need to type in, um, you'll see an image of this um, on there. It'll be kind of a screen capture of this right here. And so you need to comment on that particular post and put JTRC Team Corrali. So J-A-Y-T-E-E-R-C, and then of course, uh, Team Corrali Ford. And that way you'll be entered into the drawing. You'll have about until, uh, I believe five o'clock, um, and it's gonna be Pacific time to enter your name or just, just put that in there and it'll automatically enter you into the drawing. And it'll do an automatic drawing. It'll just draw three names and those people will win a $25 gift certificate over to Speed Tech RC. So go to Speed Tech RC's Instagram page, Go ahead and follow because we're going to be doing a lot more giveaways and drawings as time progresses on with that. So you might as well go ahead and follow them because everything won't be posted on my YouTube page. It'll be probably one or two things here, but you want to follow them over there for other posting drawings and giveaways and stuff, too. So anyway, guys, uh, I can't wait to get this out and running. Uh, it's kind of late right now, but I'm definitely going to get some batteries charged up. I'm probably just going to go ahead and use my SpeedTech uh, 6S LiPo and put that in here. It's brand new, it's fresh, and get this running and get this out and running um, just so you guys can see this tested out there. Take it out there, probably run off road for a little bit, and then I'll definitely get it ready for a super speed Saturday test, stock out the box before we start doing some modifications. I kind of want to run it stock for a bit before we start um, putting spools and doing modifications and stuff to it. So anyway, put your comments down below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos. Thanks for watching.